morning students today we will discuss the objective types of question answers of chapter 9 standard 6 ss and today it is the sixth lecture okay standard 6 ss chapter 9 and today it is the sixth lecture okay in in the lecture 4 and 5 we discuss the small question answers now today we are going i am going to deal with mcqs true and false identify like that objective types of question answer in gujarati we say vaikalpik okay now multiple choice question four options are given and among these four we have to choose only one correct answer okay number 1 which planet is which planet is closest to the sun which planet is closest to the sun surya pachi pehla ma pehlo grah kayo which planet comes first okay options are there mercury venus neptune and earth so what is the correct answer the correct answer is mercury what is that correct answer is mercury mercury is the first closest to the sun and in the book it is given nice sentence is given in order to remember the all the planets okay second by which by which name is the zero degree latitude known by which name by which name is the zero degree latitude known we have already discussed this thing okay there are 181 latitudes how many latitudes are there 181 latitudes are there 90 latitudes above the equator 90 latitudes below the equator and in a center in a center that is called zero degree Zero degree that is called equator. Okay, we, my dear student, here I would like to say zero degree latitude equator. It is the biggest. It is the biggest latitude. So, the mota ma moti latitude. Okay, so zero degree latitude that is called equator. That is called equator. It is the biggest. It is the biggest latitude. Okay, and how many total latitudes are there? 181 okay so zero degree latitude that is called equator okay by which name is the zero degree latitude no four options are given equator tropic of capricorn greenwich and tropic of cancer okay so what is the correct answer equator my dear student if we say tropic of capricorn tropic of capricorn it is 23.5 degree s south tropic of capricorn means 23.5 degree s that is called tropic of capricorn greenwich that is 0 degree but it is not latitude that it is longitude 0 degree that is longitude okay greenwich and tropic of cancer that is 23.5 degree 23.5 degree n not that is called tropic of cancer so zero degree that is called equator got it next which zone is located which zone is located between 23.5 degree n till 66.5 degree n okay which zone is located between 23.5 degree and not latitude not latitude till 66.5 degree not latitude which is there yeah here four options are given temperate zone torrid zone frigid zone and all of these okay my dear student here the area the area lying between tropic of cancer till arctic circle and tropic of capricorn till antarctic circle 
that is called temperate zone that is called temperate zone it means the area lying between tropic of cancer means 23.5 degree and till arctic circle 66.5 degree north and 23.5 degree s that is called tropic of capricorn till antarctic circle 66.5 degree s that in that area that is called temperate zone and there sun rays fall it means a moderate climate is the moderate okay moderate sun, uh, sun rays are there not much heat not much cold okay moderate okay so which zone is located between 23.5 degree north latitude and 66.5 degree north latitude the correct answer is temperate zone torrid zone means uh, the area lying between both the tropics the area lying between both the tropics tropic of cancer till tropic of capricorn that is called torrid zone and frigid zone area lying between arctic circle till north pole and antarctic circle till south pole that is called frigid zone okay next one i make an angle i make an angle of 23.5 degree on my axis identify me who am i okay we have to say okay i make an angle of 23.5 degree on my axis what is that that is earth that is earth here options are given earth venus sun and moon okay so what is the correct answer earth next how many times in a year how many times in a year does the sun intersect the equator okay how many times in a year does the sun intersect the equator options are given twice thrice or three times four times and once and the correct answer is twice two times okay how many times two times twice correct answer is twice next because of whose obstruction big field runs because of whose obstruction is the solar eclipse seen on the earth we have when i explain solar eclipse we know okay sun is there sun is there and earth is there in between what comes in between moon comes and moon stops the rays okay and that is called that is called solar eclipse okay so because of whose obstruction is the solar eclipse seen on the earth so options are given moon sun or and none of these the correct answer is moon okay the correct answer is moon so sun is there earth is there and in between what comes moon and because of that because of that we have solar eclipse got it next one which of the following which of the following is included in solar system which of the following is included in solar system four options are given planets and satellites second meteorite comet and all of this my dear student the correct answer is all of this got it dear student next question is which of the following statement which of the following statements regarding a planet and its speciality regarding a planet and its speciality is incorrect incorrect photo che okay here four options are given among three among four three are correct and one is incorrect we have to identify that which is incorrect which of the following statements regarding a planet and its speciality is incorrect okay 
Now here four options are there. Mars, blue colored bright planet. B. Jupiter, biggest planet of the solar system. C. Mercury, planet closest to the sun. And D. Venus, brightest planet. My dear student, Mars, Mars is considered as a red planet. Not blue planet. Mars is considered as a red planet. Lal graph kya wama wache, red planet. Okay. So that statement is incorrect. Which is incorrect? This statement is incorrect. Okay. Otherwise, Jupiter, it is the biggest uh, planet of the solar system. That is also correct. Mercury is closest to the sun. That is also correct. And Venus, brightest planet. That is also correct. But that statement is wrong. Mars, blue colored. No, blue, red color. Okay. Next one. Earth is not round. Earth is not round like a ball. We know earth is round, but not like a ball. Like a tennis ball, volleyball, football. It's not like that. Okay. Earth is not round like a ball, but it is like and blank. Like and blank. What is that? Orange, apple, both A and B and none of this. So correct option is orange. Correct option is orange. Okay. So we know it is just like orange. Got it? So correct option is orange. Which of the following statement? Which of the following statement is incorrect regarding latitude and longitude? Okay. Which statement is incorrect? Incorrect. Okay. Number one, zero degree longitude. Zero degree longitude is called international date line, and after crossing it, date and date changes. Zero degree longitude passes through Greenwich city of London. Horizontal lines on globe are latitudes and vertical lines on globe are longitude. My dear student, here this statement is wrong. Why? Zero degree longitude passes through Greenwich city of London while international deadline, international deadline, when we pass it, when we pass it, it day and date is changed and that is not 0 degree, that is 180, 180 degree. So here 0 degree is written, that is why it is wrong. Okay, it's not 0 degree, 180 degree longitude. When we pass 180 degree longitude, that is called IDL, international date line. And when we pass it, when we cross it, day and date are changed. Okay, so which longitude it is? 180, 180, not 0. So that statement is incorrect. Otherwise, 0 degree longitude passes through Greenwich City. Correct. Okay, that is called GMT, Greenwich Mean Time. Okay, horizontal lines, that is called latitude. That is also correct statement. And vertical lines are called longitude. That is also correct statement. Okay. So wrong one is that one. Which of the following statement is true? True means correct. Which, which of the following statement is true regarding IDL, international date line? Okay. All four options are given. 180 degree longitude. International line, line that is called 180 degree, 180 degree longitude. Yeah, correct answer. This option is correct. Okay. Because it is said which of the following statement is true, Karu, true regarding international date line. So 180 degree longitude that is international date line. Correct statement. Second one. After crossing it, date and date changes. That is also correct. Okay. That is also correct. So A and B both are correct. C passes through Pacific Ocean and is exact. That is also correct. C option is also correct. A is also correct. B is also correct. C is also correct. That is why here I have written all of these. Okay. Means all three options are correct. Okay. 
when we consider about IDL international date line that is 180 degree longitude passes through Pacific Ocean zigzag and when we cross it the day and date changes okay so all three options are correct as that the correct answer is all the above all the above okay now next one after how many years after how many years does the leap year reoccur after how many years we have leap year and when we have leap year it means in that year at that time in month of in month of february in month of february we add one more day we add one more day that is called 29th february okay continue three years we have 28 days in february and after four years we have 29 29th february that is called 29th february we have one more day okay so continue three years we have 365 days and after that fourth year we have 366 days okay after four years so after how many years does the leap year reoccur so after four years how many years after four years leap year reoccur i said now in order to complete one revolution the earth takes 365 days and six hours but when we count six hours it creates chaos that is why it is not counted but, but these six hours we keep in spare when these six hours turns into one full day that why one full day is added so after four years after four years we have one more day one more day and that is added in month of February at that year at that year 29 days are there in month of February and whole year 366 days are there dear students my next exercise is identify me money or co identify me who am i who on to okay identify me number one i am called i am called a giant planet also a biggest planet so which is the biggest planet jupiter what is that jupiter no jupiter is called a biggest planet So Jupiter it is called the biggest planet. I am called a giant planet also. Where, which, is, which one it is? That is called Jupiter. Date has to be changed. Date has to be changed while crossing me. What is that? I D L. I D L means international date line okay id l got it date has to be changed while crossing me that is called idl which is, uh, which longitude is called idl 180 degree 180 okay next one i am 90 degree south latitude 90 degree south latitude that is called south pole that is called south pole got it next i revolve around the earth i revolve around the earth that is called moon that is called moon moon takes round around the earth okay the moon the moon moves around the earth and earth moves around the sun okay what it next if i were not there if i were not there the organisms would be existed 
if if i were not there the organism would be extinct what is that that is sun okay if sun is not there there should not be anything on earth okay next one is true or false true or false number 1 the moon is the moon is self illuminated no that is wrong that is wrong that is false statement okay second one neptune is a blue colored planet yeah it is correct that this statement is correct okay third one the horizontal imaginary lines the horizontal imaginary lines drawn on the globe are called latitudes that is also correct okay next one on 21st june it is winter on tropic of cancer false it is not winter that is false statement okay next one it is very cool on equator that is also wrong statement okay now next one 90 degree north latitude that is called north pole true that statement is true okay next one the equator divides the earth into two equal parts that is also correct day and night occur due to the daily motion of the earth that is also correct okay it takes 24 hours to complete one rotation saturn is also called a turbulent planet that is also correct okay these things we have done today copy down in your notebook next time we will learn more thank you